Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. We hit 1K. Hey, we hit 1K. Hey. Okay. So guys, as y'all can tell by the title, today I'm gonna be showing you guys how I achieve this look, which is my go-to everyday makeup look. Anytime I'm going somewhere, this is how I do my face. I don't change it up. I only change it up if I learn something new. But for now, baby, this is the look. This is the beat. And if you want to know how I did it, then you have to continue to watch. So, let's get into the look. So, I know this is titled, like, Everyday Makeup Look, but I'm not, like, a big makeup girl like i don't wear makeup every day so this is more so like my go-to makeup look i do my makeup the same everywhere <laughs> everywhere i go i do my makeup like this and i just want to show y'all and also chit chat with y'all i've never like did like a chit chat video of me just talking um because i feel like those type of videos are so boring but we're gonna try it today so it's just gonna work i always start off with eyebrows um i seen this girl where she like Sorry, I seen a girl where she conceals her eyebrows first. I said I was gonna try that, but I'm not gonna do it in this video because I want y'all to see like exactly how I do my own. Um, I don't know, how y'all been? <laughs> like, how's everybody doing? Have y'all been good or have y'all been okay? Or have y'all been like, terrible? I definitely wanna get more interactive with my subscribers y'all see we hit 1k ah! okay so i definitely wanted to get on here and like thank everybody like everybody that supports everybody that literally watches every video every time i drop it like i love y'all like i really really do love y'all because i don't know that means a lot to me that people take the time out there to watch me and watch what I'm talking about and see what I'm doing like I'm somebody you know <laughs> so y'all know what I do want to talk about so I seen this girl well I seen this thing on TikTok trending of this girl talking about the what is it called the main character of a, of a friend group and I seen this girl do a video where her friends and she felt like she was the main character of her friend group. So the video kind of went viral and people were bashing her in the comments. Um, if you don't know what that means, that's basically saying like, out of all your friends, you like that girl. Out of all your friends. Like, not saying that your friends are not that girl, but out of them, you are that girl. And so, in the video, um, you know, people were bashing her in the comments, saying that she was a bad friend, um, saying that she was wrong for posting it, and things like that. And I guess I just, I'm kind of curious to see how other people would, like, review it and what they would think about it. Me, personally, out of my friend group, I feel like... Out of all of us, there's no main character. Um, in a sense, I feel like depending. Okay, if we was really breaking this down like main character. I'm like, it depends on the movie. <laughs> it depends on whatever the movie is. Then I would have to see. Okay, she would be the main character. She, you know what I'm saying? But if we was just like put in a movie about us, I feel like none of us would be main characters. I feel like. Um, I feel like none of us would be individually a main character. I personally feel like we're all main characters. Like, 
in my friend group, we're all just so different individually. And so I just feel like if we was all put in a movie, we all could be the main character. Like, I feel like I have those friends where we just all them girls. Like, hey, shoot me in a line, which I ain't, so put the gun away. At the same time, I do feel like there are certain friend groups where there are certain girls who are the main characters. And there's certain friend groups where everybody is not a main character. And this girl kind of explained it really good. What I took as a definition of what a main character is. But she said something in the video that I didn't like. And I'm actually going gonna, gonna to show y'all the video, actually. We'll put the video on here so y'all can see what the girl said. This video going around of this girl who says she's the main character in her friend group and she's getting so much hate about it. And I didn't want to like stitch the video or anything because I feel like it's already getting enough traction. So if you know, you know. But in that video, I'm not going to lie, when she showed her whole friend group, she is the main character. And I don't think that she was comparing herself to her friends like in a negative way. But when you have that main character type of essence about you, like when you know you know and i may just be siding with her because i have main character character syndrome too and now i don't have a friend group i have friends and they all have their own friend group but everywhere i go i do feel like i'm the main character i feel like all eyes are on me i feel like it's on me to carry the vibe to you know make everybody feel good make sure everybody's having a good time some people naturally have an essence to them that draws attention to them now does this mean that I feel that I'm better than anybody else. <clears throat> no, it does not mean that. To me, main character vibe just means that my presence is wanted wherever I go. I'm loved, I'm admired, I'm, I'm sought after. And there's nothing wrong with that. There can be multiple main characters in the room, but I just know I'm one of them bitches in every room that I step in. And I feel like that's confidence. And people are always like triggered when somebody else has confidence and it has nothing to do with anybody else it has everything to do with that person and how that person feels about themselves and the internet wanted to be so nice when it came to her friend group no all of her friends are not pretty and that's not me saying that i look better than them or anything like that i'm speaking on her friend group all those girls are not pretty and she was a really nice friend for saying that they are all bad bitches because they're really not y'all know i love to say the things that everybody is thinking but too scared to say so hate me if you want to i had to post that video and my skin is fucking popping so why not you know share my two cents while i'm glowing in the video you could see that she basically was kind of like said that the girls in the original video um were not pretty and not bad bees or whatever the case may be but I just feel like females like that are just so funny to me because like she kind of high-key judged these girls off a 10 second video and decided to say that they weren't pretty and not bad bitches but it's just like mm -hmm. who are you to determine whether she's a bad bitch or not you know what I mean who, who are you to determine that And then my thing is, what what makes a girl a bad? What, what makes her that? I'm curious, because you said they were, the girl said that the girls were not pretty in the video. But me personally, I feel like looks don't make you a bad bee. Like, how you look has nothing to do with you being a bad, a bad, B-I-T-C-H, sorry. I don't wanna curse on here. If you were independent, you are independent, <laughs> but no, if you independent, you on your stuff, you provide for yourself, you know, you make sure your bills is paid, if you got kids, you provide for your kids, you make sure yourself is straight, you treat self good, you are confident, how are you not a bad bitch? How? Let me know. And I feel like too, it has nothing to do with money either. It has nothing to do with your income, how much you make, or what you got saved, or what's in your bank account. 
And if you disagree, let me know in the comments because I want to talk about it. Comment, comment down below what makes you a bad bee. Let me know. How are you a bad bee? I want to know. What makes a female a bad bee? And if you if you if you, were, if you were a boy watching this, I want to know too. I want to know what's y'all definition of a bad a bad girl. Uh, I'm gonna start saying girl. I'm not gonna keep saying bee, but a bad girl. What what's, what what makes a woman a bad girl to y'all? And then comment down below if you feel like you're the main character in your friend group, and why are you the main character in your friend group? I said me and my friends. That's all of us. Like. It ain't none of us more than the other, depending on the location, you know what I'm saying, depending on the vibe, everything, like, mm -hmm. just all of us. I'm supposed to be explaining to y'all what I'm doing, huh? So, I already told y'all I start with eyebrows, so right now I just fill them in, and I just conceal them with, just thank you for all in. Conceal them with my pro concealer in the shade Toffee. I don't like my brows to be very thick. Oh, I'm sorry, the battery out. Get a right. The key to eyebrows, if y'all really want to know, the like the secret to eyebrows is keeping your pencil sharper. If you use a pencil, but that's like the key to me. Keep your pencil sharper. So now that I did that, I just took a brush, which I probably got this from the hair store. It's like. Yeah, I take this brush right here and I just like blend the concealer in around my brows. And my brows are not done too, so they will look a lot better if they were done. I could do my eyebrows a lot better when they're arched and they've been freshly done. But I mean, I haven't been getting my eyebrows done because. I tried to do it myself and I cut them off and so I need them to grow back. Now, I'm gonna go in with my, my NARS foundation which I just started using foundation. I've never been a foundation girl. But um, I use the color Syracuse in NARS. And I just take it and Like I said, never been a foundation girl, so. And yes, this is how it's supposed to come out, but it always comes out in the little stick thing. So that's just how they put it on. So I take my milk um, setting spray. I spray my sponge just a little bit. And then I go in with my foundation. I feel like 21 and I feel like our 20s is such a odd stage like I don't know it's just like we're really trying to figure out who we are in these in these times of our life and I feel like it's so weird like ugh, why don't I already know who I am or what I want out of life I know what I want, but like, 
I don't know how to explain it. East of me feels like I don't really know myself. Like, I don't really know who am I is. Um, I kind of just, I don't know. Like, do y'all understand what I'm saying? Like, sometimes I just be feeling like I don't really know who I really am. Okay, now we're going with concealer. And I use the color suede in the concealer and I just... Guys, I'm not a makeup artist, so please don't shoot me. Okay. <laughs> so I'm doing this wrong. Let me just say, this is how I do my face. Okay. This is how I do it, and this is how I like it. And I'm not saying that I'm not open for growth because I am. <laughs> I could probably do my face a lot better. But for right now, baby, this gets it done. Okay, now I'm going to contour. And I use <laughs> an old contour palette, baby. From the house, though, I use this color right here to contour. And I use a brush like this. Dab it up on there. Take the NARS. 
blush and tore it. Put these little lashes on real quick. After that, I take my Morphe It's Alive gloss that I got for my birthday like two years ago. But I'm in love with it. And I'll put that on top. And this is the final look. Let me show y'all. And um, ooh, my lips look so pink right now, y'all. But. Very simple, very natural, very cute. This is how I do my face. And that's it guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Um, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell. Turn on your post notifications. Let me focus. Turn on your post notifications. Y'all will be notified. Why am I whispering? <clears throat> Turn on y'all post notifications so y'all can be notified every time I drop a brand new video, period. We didn't hit 1K, baby, so you know it's only up from here. Comment down below what type of video, what type of content, things like that that y'all want to see. Because I'm doing this for y'all and for me because I love you too. But yeah, I want to make sure my subscribers are happy. So yeah, comment down below how you feel about the face. Because I'm loving it. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba, I'm loving it. Okay, I am so naive, hey, and I, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Make sure, make sure, make sure, make sure y'all click the description for all my Amazon finds. Um, visit my storefront. Follow me on all my social medias, TikTok, Instagram. And, yeah, I am so naive, hey, and I'm signing out. Love.